Social media analyst says Hurd's expert witness failed to provide evidence that negative tweets caused her downfall Bania testified on Tuesday that Ron Schnell, a social media forensic expert, failed to provide evidence that negative tweets caused her downfall Schnell previously testified that there were negative tweets about Amber Heard and Johnny Depp between January 2018 and January 2021, which totaled 2.38 million. Schnell said the majority of negative tweets against Heard came in April 2020, when Heard accused Johnny Depp's attorney, Adam Waldman, of leaking stories about her online that claimed she was lying about being a victim of domestic abuse. But Bania told jurors Tuesday that Schnell provided no evidence of causation, the negative tweets caused Heard economic downfall. There's actual a downward use of the hashtags, so I'm not seeing any correlation as it relates to the Waldman statements and any spikes here as it relates to the hashtags Mr. Schnell chose, Bania said. Dot he added that Schnell failed to link the spikes in the Twitter hashtags to the Waldman statements. Amanda Knox has said neither Johnny Depp nor Amber Heard will truly win in the feuding ex's defamation trial a spectacle, because there are trauma, pain and ugliness has been paraded before millions of people. Knox, 34 who has faced public backlash more than a decade after she was wrongfully convicted of the 2007 murder of British University student Meredith Kircher in Italy, said she feels sorry for Heard and Depp, declaring they have also faced the public's unforgiving and unaccountable judgment. The American said she is still dealing with the psychological trauma of the public shaming she endured during her sensational trial over the murder of Kircher, 21, that made international headlines. Knox said that high-profile trials can no longer happen without the public speculating, accusing, slandering, threatening, and objectifying those on trial for their own moral crusades. Writing in The Independent in an op-ed, Knox wrote, Who wins in a trial like this? Not Depp. Not Heard. Not us. But can't we condemn the spectacle and yet still sift the evidence to arrive at our conclusions about the guilt? and innocence of these two human beings whose trauma and pain and ugliness has been paraded before us? I'm not going to tell you my opinion on the Depp v. Heard trial. My opinion is just that, an opinion, and it doesn't matter. And frankly, neither does yours, Depp's team again called Douglas Bania, a social media and intellectual property analyst, who previously testified on May 2nd.